I fuck with Shawty cause she bout her business, ayy. She independent and she on a mission, ayy. Been through some shit, but now it's better living, ayy. What's up, Flavor Squad? It's your girl, Fashionisha, here to give you all the flavor. If you are new here, make sure you hit that like button, make sure you subscribe, and make sure you comment down below. Hashtag Flavor Squad. If you are not new here, I thank you so much for coming back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing my very first Shein try on haul and I'm so excited because y'all I didn't had so many carts from Shein but I've never cashed out because I was scared and I know I'm not the only one so yeah I've just decided to just you know try it try them out and I'm not that disappointed but I am a little disappointed so we might as well just start off with the bag let's start off with the bag and then we're going to work our way up to the good okay i ordered some shoes you know I ordered some shoes trying to give them a chance i've been wanting some square toed heels and i got these they were supposed to be white i don't know if you can tell but they're kind of a cream color instead of white they're not really white they're kind of cream so i don't I'm probably still going to try to wear these just because I bought them and I'm not sending them back. So yeah, I'm probably going to still try to wear them, but I don't know. I just don't know about these. Now the next pair of square toe heels I got were just regular black. They're just regular black square toe heels and y'all, I don't know what this feel like. It feels like, um, I remember that stuff we used to, we used to make the little strings they used to fold over what do we call them i don't know but we used to make the keychains and stuff out of the little strings this is what this feels like it feels so cheap it feels just bad and my foot doesn't fit in the arch i don't know if it's too arched or something but my foot doesn't fit in this arch so it's just all bad and it's just really cheaply made and i just I can't with this shoe. I got them both in a size 7, but I just can't with this shoe, okay? We're not going to do that. So that's over. So now we're going to move on to the hats that I bought. I got this three-pack of skull caps, pink, white, and black. These are really cute. Really good quality. Really thick. This is how they look. I really love these. Super, super thick. I'm really surprised on the quality of these. I'm just gonna try one on so you guys can see how it looks on me. Super cute, super thick, super warm. I love it, I love it. If you know me, you know I love hats. And that skull caps, bucket hats, baseball caps, I love hats, so. Okay, the first hat is this cap that just says Batty. It's just a simple black cap with Batty and pink and like a Barbie font. This is really cute. Fits my head really nice. I like this hat. Listen, I look like a Barbie right now too, huh? <laughs> this is so cute. This fits really nicely and it's really thick too. It's like really good quality. The next hat we have is this olive green cap and it says game, play it, and tan font. This is super cute as well, cause you know, the only way you gonna win the game is if you play it, sis, you gotta get in there. This is super cute. I like this hat. Once again, super good quality, fits my head nicely. I don't have the biggest head, so it's not hard for me to find hats. Next, we have this tan bucket hat. This is so cute. It's really giving me a 90s vibe and it's corduroy if you can see it, do, it does have the corduroy pattern super good quality very thick this is cute y'all it's the hats for me it's the hats for me so far like yes look at this with this melanin come on now come on can't tell me this ain't cute. The last hat I have is this black bucket hat with this yellow butterfly on it. It's just a black hat with a yellow butterfly on it. Super simple, super cute. I do have a fit in mind. I just gotta find the right top. That's it. Gotta find the right top. This is so cute. Fits really well. Super thick. It's not thin and cheap. It fits so good. Like, I really like this hat. This is cute. I 
I feel like I'm finna just go jump out in a 90s R&B, 90s hip hop video, you know. <laughs> okay, let's move on, let's move on. Okay, the first clothing piece I have is this sweatshirt that I have on. It's a crop sweatshirt, black, and it says time is money, which is true, cause you know, period. This is really cute, super comfortable. It's not too thick, not too thin. It's very good quality. Like, this is so cute. It has a thick wristband here. This is the true color of the pink. This is really cute. I got it in a size small and it fits very well. Okay, let's go to the neck. Okay, y'all, before we get into this one, that last one shirt, the neck, who I'm tired. The neck, it was like hard to get out of the collar like it didn't stretch that much so it was hard to get in and out of I almost forgot to tell y'all but yeah it's still cute though so next we have this two color sweatshirt pink and gray just says Los Angeles super cute I got a size small by the way and this is so soft this is better quality than the last one and the last one was really good this is what the wrist looks like it's more fitted than the last one it's really cute it's so soft i wish i could feel it it's soft on the outside and the inside it'll really keep you warm too cute show you the back never been to la but this was cute so i had to you know cop this pink and gray i love gray it's an accent color and i love pink because it's my favorite color period so the next item is this long sleeve cropped shirt this is really different for me it was like out of the norm because it's so graphic and I don't usually go for super graphic things but this is cute on me and I like it I feel like you'll definitely have to wear a jacket with this or some type of coat if you're wearing it in the fall or the winter time because it's super thin it's like it's not super thin but it's breathable I feel like if I step outside I'm still gonna be super cold even though it's long sleeve but it is cute give you guys a close up It's really cute it's not that bad when raising your arms you have to be a little careful though because it is really cropped it's really cropped let's move on to the next okay the next item is this cutout hoodie not the tank top but this tank top is a part of my brand so if you want to check out my brand just click the link in the description okay but this top is super cute it was different so i did want to try it out I will probably actually tie this up. No, I like it hanging. I like it hanging. But this is super cute. I feel like you could definitely create a streetwear outfit with this. Something chill. It's uh, it's pretty thin. It's pretty thin. It's to be cute, not comfortable. So, yeah. But I really like this. I like that you can style it with any type of tank top you want. Any type of crop top that you want. So, you can really do a lot with this. I got mine in a size small, by the way. I wouldn't suggest sizing up or down in this. I would just say get your regular size because I feel like if I would have sized down, the arms would have been a little too short. They already kind of short right here. This is really short, actually, but it's not that bad because it's not supposed to be perfect. It's not that type of it's not that type of party. It's not supposed to be perfect. So it's still cool with me that the arms are short. But if I would've got like an extra small, no ma'am. No ma'am, I would've had quarter length sleeves. That's not okay. So let's move right on to the next item. Okay, the next piece is this silk or satin long sleeve top. It has the nice droop here for a little, you know, cleavage, not too much actually. It's really not too much at all, but this is a nice detail on the shirt. I got mine in a size small. I would have, I would say that I could have gotten an extra small, but if I would have gotten an extra small, I think it would have been too short because it's not that long as a shirt. I did tuck it into these pants, but it's not that long already. So yeah, it's really comfortable, super flowy. Fits nice to me. I feel like with the right bottoms, it's gonna be perfect. This is really cute. It's giving me brunch vibes, you know brunch with the girls i have them paired with these bronze colored pants from shein 
I also have in a size small. I do think for sure I could have sized down to an extra small so that all this extra fabric wouldn't be here. But overall, they do fit nice. They're not too tight. It goes really well with this top. They're stretchy. They're super stretchy. So that's why I said I could have definitely gotten an extra small. However, I did not know they were going to be this stretchy. I thought they were going to be super stiff. They are... They make noise a little bit, but it's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's not as bad as them pants, you know, from the other hall. <laughs> These are super cute, though. Maybe I should just gain a little weight, you know. Get a little more junk in the trunk, and I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Okay, next we have this super cute lantern sleeve off the shoulder crop top. This is so cute. It also has that corset effect. It goes really cute with these pants, so I just kept the pants on. This is so cute and it's different for me because I am not dramatic or like extra, but this is really extra to me because of the sleeves. But this is so cute. This is cute. I was nervous about this. I ain't gonna lie. I was a little nervous. Let's see if I can show you guys the back. Maybe day night, something, dinner, something. I got this in a size small, by the way, and I think it fits perfect. Can't go any lower. So let's move on to the next item. Next, I have these rib knit wide leg pants. These are super comfortable. I got a size small though, and I think I most definitely should have gotten an extra small. But now I know for the future. They feel so good. They're super flowy. They fit nice. They even go with this shirt. I'm not going to lie. These are supposed to be, you know, comfortable, but just lounging. But they really go with this top I have on. And it just makes, it just gives these pants a little extra oomph. You know, I would definitely say to size down on this. Because although they are small, they are like, I don't know. It's like I have to pull these all the way up in order for them to really fit me. Because if I was to pull them down, girl, uh-uh. So I have to pull them all the way up in order for them to fit me. But yeah, super cute. Either way, I like them. So that's all that matters. Okay, the next items are this two-piece set. The pants are just like the last wide leg rib knit pants. And I got this one actually in the extra small and it fits so much better than the last pair of pants. Super cute. This top is so cute. It just fits nice. It's great quality. I'm just so happy. Like, oh my gosh. This is so cute. It looks so good on my skin as well. This fits nice. Like, yes, she in. This is perfect. This is like perfect for any night out, like just chilling. This is cute. Put you a nice coat on with it. Hold on, what I got? Oh, I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna show you later. I'm gonna show you later. But this is so cute. It's just soft. It feels so good. It feels good. I'm not trying to take this off, honestly. I'm really not trying to take this off. This is cute. This is perfect, like, yes. Okay, on to the next item. The next item is this lace up to crop top. It has the lace detail in the back. This is really cute. This is a really nice top. It's a style with jeans, girl, pants, girl, skirt, anything. You could style this. I do think I could probably could have went up to a medium. <sighs> Can't breathe, y'all. This is small. But I think I could have went up to a medium. I always have this problem with tops like these. Listen. Because my boobs are medium, but my body is a small. But I definitely could have went up to a medium. But this still fits fine. It's just I think I'd be more comfortable with the medium. You know? Next we have this plaid coat. And I'm just going to pair it with this. Hey, this a look. This a look when you want to be cute and chill. Yes, this is cute. I really like this. It's not super thick, but it's not thin at all. But it's not just stupid thick. Like, it's called a coat, but it's not a coat coat, you know. 
but this is cute get into it get into it it uh it doesn't itch itch but it kind of scratches a little but it doesn't just itch like oh my god i take this off but it scratches a little you know but this is still cute it is oversized i got this in a size small and it is kind of bigger on me but i don't mind this is cute girl you can't tell me you just can't tell me uh, I look like the Grinch. Recording. Yeah, I look like the Grinch, y'all. When he was sitting in the chair and his stomach was out, that's what I look like. Hate that for me. Okay, so the last piece I have is this houndstooth long wine coat. This is really cute. It feels really good. It's really warm. Feels good on the inside and the outside, and it looks good from afar. Now let me come up closer. I don't know if y'all can tell, but you can really see right here that the houndstooth isn't really the fabric. It's not houndstooth fabric. It's like they printed the houndstooth on there, like, and it just looks really cheap close up, but it feels good. It fits. I got a size small in this. It comes down to about my calf muscles. So it's really long. I'm only 5'3", so that's really long for me. It's really warm. Like, it's such a good coat, but I feel like they took the cheapest route they could with printing this on there. And I just feel like you could have found some pounds to fabric. I know you could have found some pounds to fabric, but whatever. It's still a nice coat. Still super cute. I'm still going to wear it because I bought it. So, yeah. Hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you liked anything in this video, let me know what was your favorite piece down in the comment section below. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe as well. Don't forget to comment hashtag Flavor Squad down in the comments below. And that's all I have for you guys. May your curls pop and your grind never stop Flavor Squad. I'm out of here.